Good morning and thanks for joining us. We're starting out much warmer this morning. It is starting out at 72 degrees in Springfield right now. On south and west winds and dew points increasing. It's just pretty warm and humid out there this morning. We do have a line of storms rolling through. It's diving south and east from the Joplin area, eventually about to get into northwest Arkansas. Um, it's lost its shape a little bit since it first started to pop at about 3 o'clock this morning. Uh, but we still do have some locally heavy rain near Anderson and, of course, they don't need it. There has been some incredible flesh flooding there earlier in the week. Um, and we do have some lightning. This storm also does have a history of producing some damaging winds up near the Joplin area. With the way that it's organized, or I should say disorganized right now, it doesn't look like we'll see that. But we do have, again, heavy rain and lightning out of that. We could also have some gusty winds. Could you see that, that line that comes out ahead of the uh, boundary there? That could have some gusty winds with it as well. We do have enough of juice to keep these storms rolling at least a little bit. Uh, we've got some of that instability because look at the temperature change from yesterday. It's much warmer by about 10 to 15 degrees. It's 72 in Springfield, 70 in Branson, and 70 in Rawa. Dew points are super soupy. Um, they're in the upper 60s to about 70. So we are now way at the top at the Muggy Muda. Remember yesterday we were at the bottom, uh, and now we're humid and starting to cross over to some of those oppressive, uh, those oppressive areas. That's because we have south winds that are bringing in this muggy air mass. So as we head through the day, we're looking at a pretty hot and humid uh, feeling out there. 88 degrees today, a little bit above the average of 86. And with the humidity, those real feels will be in the lower 90s. A couple of storms this morning. We could have some redeveloping storms this afternoon, but we'll have some mostly sunny skies and an isolated storm chance. So hour by hour, we could have a few more storms pop by this afternoon. Uh, we're looking at maybe some locally heavy rain and lightning would be the threats there. 88 degrees for that high. Uh, we'll have those storms die down once the sun sets. Mostly clear, warm and humid overnight with a low of 69. By tomorrow, mostly sunny, hot and humid again. Temperatures up near 90 and with that humidity again feeling like the lower 90s. It's a, a stagnant summery pattern that will stay in pretty much through the weekend. We're looking at some hot and humid conditions with that area of high pressure, that dome of heat and humidity sitting nearby. But we'll also be able to track some weak hiccups or weak disturbances near the area, which could pop maybe an isolated storm or two daily. So again, we're expecting some hot and humid conditions. Highs near 90 through the weekend. Heat index values near 95. An isolated storm would be possible daily, but we're not looking at anything organized or widespread. Most of us will wind up staying Dry. Here are the highs through the week. You can see up near 90 through the weekend and then into early next week, all above average of 86. That heat index will be uh, pretty warm out there today and tomorrow, 93. As we get towards the weekend, a little bit stickier. That heat index approaches the middle and upper 90s. So you just want to make sure you have lots of water and sunscreen. 88 degrees today. A couple of storms possible. will be hot and humid. Uh, still humid overnight, only dropping to 69 degrees by tomorrow. Mostly sunny, hot and humid. 89 will feel like 93 once you tack on the humidity. Temperatures up near 90 by Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Still pretty summery, but mostly sunny skies. Staying hot early next week.